Fans are buzzing. Teams are gliding into position here for the start of the third. Well, here we go. The puck is dropped on period number three. Well, it's been a fun one here tonight as the third period is underway. Ray, what did you make of the first two periods? The Avs really should be pretty pleased with the style of game they've played. They have the puck a lot, but they're losing because they have not found a way to finish. Los Angeles gains the zone and on the attack. The Avalanche have taken possession along the wall. Oh, that's a good hit. And there's the save. Corpus is going to cover it up and get a whistle. Even with the traffic starting to close in, he had to grab that when he did. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. Los Angeles is in a dogfight. They're clinging to this 3-2 lead. Puck scooped up by Anderson. Here they come on the attack down the right side. Tries it to the crease. And a solid save on the play there. It's a really good save. In tight, he shuts down the area where the puck can go by getting out onto the puck, and there's nowhere for the shooter to put it. Nieto's working it around in the corner. Moves the puck. And that's broken up. Nieto's got it to the side. And that slides right out to center ice. Tosses it to Byram. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Takes it to the front, and he goes back to regroup. Oh, solid save by Tomasello. They're swarming here. Oh, look at that. Quick reflexes. You make one, you make two stop before the puck is cleared away. Great pass from off the right side. Trying to get the puck out of his own end. Rocked him in the open ice. He grabs the puck here on the point. Into the offensive end now. Angles it over to Eller. LA's got it in their own zone. Textbook poke check by Byron. The Kings get a hold of the puck along the boards. Tenacious battle for the puck along the wall. Picked up along the wall by Byron. And here's the pass to Cogliano. Tries to the crease. And now it's grabbed by Eller. The Avs looking against the half wall. Wrestling in close. Oh, a clutch save. Oh, and a misfire as that goes right out of the zone. Grabbed along the board by Byron. He carries the puck up along the wing. The Avs carried along the wall. And that banks off a stick. That opportunity is rejected. Couldn't make the connection on the play. Colorado's got a hold of it against the wall. Takes the puck behind the net. Taken by Anderson. Puck picked up by Deneau. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Girard. Shot! Oh, that slick stop by Georgiev. From the right side, they gain the zone. With possession along the wall. Denies him! Puck grabbed by Cogliano. Scooped up along the wall by Nechuskin. Oh, he keeps it out with a great reactionary stop with the toe. They are really poor on the pressure here. Corpusalo's going to hang on for a whistle here in the third. Well, there's not much time left here as you get into the final 20 minutes. The game's close. A mistake now would be critical. In the final moments of this period, LA's hanging on to this 3-2 lead. Puck scooped up by Roy. Los Angeles looks to break out in their own end. Velarde's got it against the boards. Can't find his man. The Avs have it now. Long reach breaks up the momentum. Colorado's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Great poke check on the reach. The Kings gain control of the puck. Cuts to the paint. Scores! We're all tied up! Oh, it's getting to a stage in the game where you think they're not going to be able to find the equalizer. But they they get it done. I'm not sure where he's wandering to there. The slot's way over there, pal. Get back to where you belong. Colorado's answered back here late in the third. Huge third period goal to tie things up. They've really worked hard and deserved this spot in the game. Now we'll see at even 
Do coaches really shorten their bench out and start double shifting guys? Scores! And look at that! The go-ahead goal puts him in front! They never gave up on this, James. I mean, with the game's tied, there was a few moments it looks like it's slipping away. They kept grinding at the game. Stay at it. Eventually, they get the chance, and they make the play that puts them ahead. The Avs are up by one here in the third. This is not the time for prevent, though, is it? It's way too early for that. Get after it, four check, press the play. That's the way you defend. And now it's grabbed by Watt. All alone! Scores! He had to be ready for this puck. Showed up on his stick. He doesn't take any time at all. The goalie's not set. It's in the net. Some guys panic when they get out into the clear. They're ahead of the pack. He does it. He makes a nice play and scores on the breakaway. Here in the late going to the frame, Colorado's really controlled the pace of play these last few minutes, leading by two. Passes it over to Ifo. Tries to dangle, the puck skips away. LA's goalie is on the bench. The extra attacker has jumped into the play. Here come the hats. I love this tradition, although I will tell you, they collect the hats up. They used to give them to us, and you're like, what am I going to do? I'm not wearing somebody else's hat. They'd really have to screw this up now, James, to lose. The empty netter should put it away. Both teams are set. They're ready to drop the puck. Kopitar's won the draw. Let's see what they can do with possession. the play. And as the final seconds tick away, listen to this place, recognize a hard victory. No room for that one to get through. There's the horn, and that's the hockey game. One of the oldest cliches in the book is that it's a 60-minute hockey game. They were great for 40 minutes, James. Unfortunately for them, they had to play the last one. It is stunning to think that this team began the third with a lead, and for the bottom to fall out like it did is shocking. Well, so listen to this place popping for the home team as they pay respect and homage to the home fans who pay their hard-earned money. I think this is a cool tradition that started. I'm not even really sure if it's the last 10 years or so, but when I first saw it, I didn't think it would last. Now I'm like, it absolutely belongs. It's the right thing. For Ray Ferraro, I'm Shane Sabolski. We'll see you next time we drop the puck.